Restaurants may need to consider airflow in addition to social distancing before they can open up indoor seating areas. CBS 13's Dina Kupfer explains new research finds the virus can travel farther than six feet if it's caught in an airstream. Most restaurants across the state have been operating on a strictly takeout basis since the middle of March. But as these businesses begin to modify their dining rooms in order to reopen, turns out there's a lot to consider. Not all of it has to do with keeping customers six feet apart. There are instances of transmission over distances much greater than six feet. Um, and so uh, these, these expiratory particles, you can't see them. They're so small they get carried along by little... Uh, air currents. We spoke with UC Davis professor of chemical engineering William Ristenpart, who says the amount of airflow in a space should also be considered. If there's not very good ventilation, then you're effectively sitting there breathing in other people's exhaled air for a much longer time period, maximizing the probability of inhaling one of these particles that has a virus. I would not feel safe even in a restaurant with the tables more than six feet apart if they had very poor ventilation. A recent study out of China shows how one customer with COVID-19 spread the disease to nine others. But look at the pattern of infection. Some people seated at the diner's table and at the one in front and behind were infected, but no one at the table next to it was. A team of researchers from UC Davis and the University of Oregon published a paper focusing on minimizing viral transmission in buildings. We created a conceptual visualization of how the aerosols may be spreading in that room with a, with a fan that is simply recirculating the air. Whether it was an air conditioner or just a fan moving air, the visualization is really trying to articulate how the particles get caught up in the air and move around the space. The team created a second animation for the same room, only with an open window. So in this conceptual visualization, what we were seeing is that with increased outside air, exchange through the open window. Particles deposit more quickly and then also be ex exhausted uh, from the airstream more quickly. As for outdoor dining, researchers say that is safer than any indoor plan.